Hello everyone, this video will show the two cases of hyperbola with center at hk. Now let's go over the first case. The first case is the horizontal hyperbola and this is its formula. Now please notice that we can form a horizontal hyperbola if the x part of the equation is positive, the one that I put inside the square. Let us locate the center of this hyperbola. Point C is the center of the hyperbola, and the uh, coordinate for the center of horizontal hyperbola is HK. Now let's locate the vertex of the hyperbola. These are the two vertices of the hyperbola, and the um, coordinate for these ver two vertices would be H plus A comma K. Now, we remember that the distance from the center to the vertex is A. We also have co-vertices, and we're going to label the co-vertices in this picture. The distance from the co-vertices to the center, or the distance from one co-vertex to the center, is B. The coordinate of the co-vertices is h, k plus b. The next part of this horizontal hyperbola are the asymptotes. In order that we can easily uh, draw the asymptote, we are going to draw a rectangle. This rectangle should cover these four points, the two vertices and the two co-vertices. The asymptotes in a horizontal hyperbola passes through the corners of the rectangle passing through the center. The equation of these two asymptotes would be y equals plus minus b over a quantity x minus h plus k. We also have the focus. The coordinates of these two foci would be h plus c comma k. Now let's move on to the second case. This graph illustrates the second case of hyperbola, which is the vertical hyperbola, and this is its formula. Now please remember that in this case, the y part of the equation is the positive part. So that's what that's very important because this will tell us that the Hyperbola is a vertical hyperbola. The one that I squared is the positive part of the hyperbola, which is the y part. Now let's locate the center of this hyperbola. This is the center C of the hyperbola. Now let's draw the two vertices of this hyperbola. These are the two vertices of this hyperbola. Now we remember that the distance from the center to the vertex is A. This tells us that the coordinate for the two vertices of this vertical hyperbola is H comma K plus A. We also have two co-vertices for vertical hyperbola. These are the two co-vertices of a vertical hyperbola, and the distance from the center to the co-vertex is B. And the coordinate of the two co-vertices would be H plus minus B comma K. This vertical hyperbola has two asymptotes. In order that we can easily sketch the asymptotes, we are going to draw a rectangle that passes through the two vertices and the two co-vertices. The two asymptotes for vertical hyperbola passes through the corners of this rectangle passing through the center. The equation of these two asymptotes for vertical hyperbola is y equals plus minus a over b quantity x minus h plus k. Now we also have two foci for this vertical hyperbola. 
The two points labeled F are the two foci of the hyperbola, and the coordinate of the two foci would be H comma K plus C. These are the two cases for hyperbola. The first case is the horizontal hyperbola, while the second case is the vertical hyperbola. That's it. If you find this video helpful, consider subscribing and hitting that like button for more math videos. See ya!